Good evening gamers out there, this is Sarge. I am bringing you a video on how to set up your PlayStation 3 DualShock 3 controller for your Windows PC. First thing you need to do is go to a website called motionenjoy.com slash download. Then you need to proceed down to version 0.7.1000 testing version. You can also get the stable version which is 6.005 but I find that for Windows 7 7.1 works just fine. Go right down here 32 and 64 bit all in one site 1 go ahead and download that. It's gonna take a few seconds depending on your internet speed but hey it's not too bad. Alright then go down here extract the files and then go right on up motion enjoy 71001 signed. Double click that and click next to basically install everything. I don't like quick launch icons. Alright, there we go. Now it's set up. Alright, click finish. Now it's going to take you to the Motion Enjoy Wiki help page sort of thing over there but you don't really need that alright now what you're gonna need to do just go ahead and exit out of this alright now this is where you want to be connected game controllers it shows the US the DualShock 3 6 axis USB that's what you want to see now go to driver manager and you're going to want to load the drivers check those boxes load drivers usually it's just going to be one but uh, this time it's two probably because this is the second time that I've done it now just click load drivers it's going to take a moment um, could take up to five minutes depending on your computer speed as you can see sometimes it goes through not responding blah 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 alright there we go should be done now okay Installing your device driver software right here. Virtual mouse, virtual keyboard. Blah, 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 blah. We'll wait till this is finished. Alright. Well, right here it says that both of these are check marked both of them are good then alright so now go over to profiles uh, we can forget about that go over to profiles now you're going to go to this one it is very important that you select the Xbox 360 controller emulator why Windows based PCs like to have games running off of the Xbox 360 controller environment because it's Windows owned by Microsoft which owns Xbox they like to make everything the same which makes PlayStation users need to work a little alright but you select the X input default which would be Xbox 360 controller test the vibration that's the uh, vibration going on in the controller just put it up to the mic then click enable alright now you should be good to go now let's see if we can get into some games. All right. All right, ladies and gentlemen, now that we are in Unreal Tournament 3, I just want to make a few notes. It is most likely going to be very important that you uh, hook up your controller and start it through the DS3 program before you start a game because sometimes it's not going to work or it's not going to uh, recognize itself within the game so you'd have to restart the game in order to get it to work now I am going to load into an instant action game uh, deathmatch uh, we'll do biohazard Let's load into the game. Now, 
I'm not very good at this with a uh, PS3 controller just yet as I have just figured this out on my own that's why I'm bringing it to you um, so let's let this load alright now as you can see the camera is moving very very fluidly you cannot do that with a mouse controller the mouse controller is going to be something like like this right here this is the mouse controller and this is the PS3 controller alright that's all the PS3 controller alright now let's get into the game match beginning in 3, 2, 1 play you are on red
This is awesome. And I didn't even know what my character looked like. That's awesome right there. Alright. Alright. Now I'm going to go back to the mouse because I don't know how to get out of this thing. Alright. That's it for this game. Have a good game. Blah, 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 blah. Have fun with your PS3 controller on PC.